Hey guys, this is uh, Tom at The Verge and we're looking at the Windows 8 touch interface and we're comparing how you access individual features on the mouse and keyboard side. So one of the first uh, things you'll, you'll notice is we're obviously on the start screen here. Um, to get to the sort of start button, you'd swipe from the right in touch and you get like, the sort of charms here. Um, on the actual keyboard and mouse way, you look, go into the very bottom right hand corner and you get translucent charms and then you hover over them and you get the start button. So task switching on the touch uh, version of Windows 8 is you swipe from the left and you can pop the Metro applications in. And to get up the task switcher interface um, on the keyboard you use the start button and tab. Okay, the next one is how we sort of get rid of applications, so how we close them. If we go into photos, you swipe from the top down and then you can literally just like drop it and that closes the application. On the keyboard and mouse side, um, you, go, you use the mouse to go to the top and you get sort of like grab and then you can grab and pull down and that drops it away. By swiping up from the bottom, we get the options menu and on the mouse, we just literally right click and that will give you the options. Um, you can also use the Windows logo key and Z. So the next gesture is pinching to zoom out. So this is the semantic zoom and you can name groups and stuff. On the uh, mouse and keyboard side, you'd hold down control and then you use the middle scroll button on the mouse to then access semantic zoom. Uh, then you can right click on, on the actual groups to rename them. Okay, so we're gonna tap to hold to rearrange this uh, application here. So you just scroll down and then you can obviously rearrange it there, but you can also scroll with another hand and then drop it in just there. And to quickly rearrange an app to, say, the end of the list, you just literally scroll with the middle mouse button and you can just drop it in. Search for an application in a tablet mode. You swipe from the right, go to the search charm, and then you type in the actual application that you need. So let's go photos. And on the uh, keyboard and mouse side, you literally just type from the start screen and then you can launch your app. As you can see, uh, Microsoft's obviously done a lot of work to make sure it's easy on the keyboard and mouse side and on the tablet side to access the various features in the start screen of Windows 8.